Hey there YouTube and world, how are you all doing? I hope you all are doing fantastic. I'm doing fantastic here. A lot of you have been asking if I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. I have a medical condition that I have to watch out for. Uh, it's related to my very high blood pressure. I have hypertension, so I'm on a strict diet. I also have another medical condition that I don't want to mention right now, but I really need to watch my diet. I can't have a lot of things that normal people can have. So I'll be honest with you guys, uh, the food reviews that you see on my channel, especially the fast food reviews, the doctors have told me not to eat them. Yeah. <laughs> it's like really restricted. I can't have those fast foods, you know, those Popeye chickens, those KFC chickens, those Wendy's burgers. It's not allowed because uh, once I eat those, uh, since they are very high in cholesterol and also they contain a huge amount of red meat you know and cheese and dairy and all those things and sugar in the bun uh, this is not good for my blood pressure actually it's not good for anybody but people do still have them you know eat them so yeah, I gotta be honest with you guys. I'm not allowed to have those, but I did those. I did those because I wanted to make YouTube videos. <laughs> I want to get, I wanted to get views, but it looks like it's not worth it. So the doctors have told me to stay out of it. Of course, I don't eat them every day. I was having them maybe once a month. So and, and sodas, you know, Coca-Cola, Pepsi, Fanta, Sprite, whatever it is, pop sodas. I can't have them because they're full of sugar and they have phosphorus which really harms your internal organs you know the black liquid that really harms you internally so i can't have those as well the other thing would be i'm i'm allowed to have white rice which i have a lot i'm allowed to have veggies all the green veggies you know all the different color of veggies and then I'm uh, allowed to have all the berries, so I need to stick to my diet and then, you know, I wasn't feeling well a few weeks ago because I was, you know, shifting out of my diet and then suddenly my blood pressure went high, very high, and I went to see the doctor and in the doctor's office, I really had a very very high reading so doctors were saying okay what's going on why is this reading like this you're on medication you're on diet and I had to be honest with the doctor and I told them told my doctor I, I actually have two doctors and they see me together because I'm a complicated patient so I told my doctors um, I gotta be honest with you guys I wasn't following my diet and now I'll try to follow my diet and oh, the other thing is salt. I was, uh, I actually cook and eat at home. I cook every day. And when I was cooking, at first, when I recovered, I wasn't having salt. And then slowly, you know, salt is such a thing that when you, once you put on your food, uh, and you keep putting more and more and more every day, you don't, you don't understand or you don't know how much salt has increased, you know? So sodium is really bad for you. 
sodium is a no-no, especially for our blood pressure uh, patients and hypertension, and those who are suffering from hypertension, those who have heart trouble, those who have uh, kidney troubles. It's not a, it's not a good thing. Sodium, you have to like really cut down on sodium. So the doctors were saying your blood reading, you know, the blood work says you have a lot of sodium in your blood. So I had to get rid of the sodium and. Also, I had to include physical activity. Like, I, I was driving a lot. I wasn't walking. I wasn't uh, doing a lot of exercise, you know. Not like the strenuous exercise, not physical fitness. It's like walking. I wasn't walking at all. So, so now, every evening, I go out for a walk, like 20 minutes walk, sometimes 30 minutes walk. What I do is, uh, I have a red box in front of my house. Uh, it's it's kind of like you know a mile and a half away or two miles away. What I do is go and rent a DVD uh, in the red box and then come back and then the other day the next day I re I go out to return. It's like I have something to do when I go out walking. So I have a destination I reach and then I actually have uh, motivation to walk. So. That's how I started to walk, and I've been walking, and I have reduced my weight. I am not overweight at all, but I have a limit according to my body structure and my height. I have actually a limit that I need to follow, a weight limit. So that weight limit has to be very strict, you know. So, yeah, and then... I was able to get my weight down a lot, that's one good thing. I was able to get down my sodium intake, yay, and I, my blood pressure is really, really under control now. So the doctors gave me like 90 days to get my sh shit together, you know, get my things right, or get organized and get on the path uh, to living a healthy life. And I'm, I'm doing that right now so let's hope this works out and let's hope you know I was able to give you guys some pointers on living a healthy life you know who doesn't want a healthy life who doesn't want to be you know fit who doesn't want to stay fit nobody likes over being overweight and nobody likes being sick so yeah that's all for today and thank you for all the support thank you for all the love and save smallest channels and I'm a creator yeah Stay cool, everybody, and stay fantastic. Oh, yeah.